Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. The show has an NL East matchup. It's the Washington Nationals taking on the Philadelphia Phillies. Alongside Chris Singleton, I'm John Chump. Just about set to go now. And on the mound now, Aaron Nolan. Tell us about him in that sub-3 ERA, Singy. Well, anytime you can keep your ERA under three, you're doing a lot of things right, and you're putting your team in a position to win a lot of ball games as well. And he's doing tremendous out there on the mound. Every time he gets the ball, you expect him to go out there and dominate, and that's what he's been to this point. We'll see how he is today. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted him first base with a quick free pass. Check swing, and that's a ball. When Nola was in college at LSU, he got a chance to play with his brother, Austin, who was the team's shortstop, and as well, his roommate was Alex Bregman. Two walks in the first has to be some cause for concern. I mean, you're talking about a guy you want to pitch deep into the ball game. It's not going to help with the pitch count right there. They can't afford to hand out three bases at this rate. And now it's going to be Yadiel Hernandez. Next offering is downstairs. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. Robles on second. Garcia at first. One gone. Checks his swing. Now an appeal to third. No, he held up. Puts it in the air out towards left center, and that'll fall for a base hit. Runner around third. He scores on the board first. It's one zip. Comes through with the RBI. That ball right there landed in what they call a no man's land, meaning it's not really a spot on the field where you can expect anyone to get to it easily. I mean, it's a tough play going back for the shortstop, but also for the. And that one is lifted in the air. He makes the grab. Runner tagging from third. He's in on the sacrifice fly. It's 2 0. Sometimes all you got to do is your job and don't overcomplicate things. Keep it simple. Runner in third, less than two outs. Put the ball in play and a nice job with the sack fly. Well, they're really running up the pitch count in this first inning. Lots of confidence from this team that is perhaps the hottest in baseball right now. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. Well, he hasn't gotten the result yet, but it's got to feel pretty confident. Three. A swing and a miss. That retires the sack. We go to the bottom of the first. Trey Turner at the plate. And the pitch. Two one. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. Call. Pulls it down. And there's one down. JT Real Muto steps in. Didn't play in last night's game. A little breather for him. And that's ball, ball four. Outside. Now, this was a story we were paying attention to before the game. We've seen him give up walks in the past, and it's an issue once again early on. And now here is Harper. Swings and misses. One and two. Just oh. missed. It's a good take. Two, two. That's out to center field. Robles has a beat on it. Makes the grab, and there's two gone. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. Ninth in the NL in home runs. Strasburg to first. Real Muto back easily. Now remember, Kyle Schwarber grew up in Ohio, and so he got a chance to watch a lot of really good Cincinnati Reds teams. His favorite players growing up were Barry Larkin and Ken Griffey Jr. The count two and one. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Kicks and deals. And yeah, that's outside. 3-2, okay. two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. Goes down, swinging for the strikeout. 
pulled the strip. Back here, Citizens Bank Park. New inning getting started, and it's Michael Chavis at the plate. The wind of the pitch. Started to go after it. Now a look down to first. Nope, he held back. And here comes. That one the other way. And that's a fair ball. Around first, heading for two. And he starts off the second with a double. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch to play lately. That was maybe even a little off the plate, but no problem getting the barrel to it. Man, he does such a nice job, and that's what you're supposed to do with the pitch in that location. The one, two, just oh. missed. Singy, he wasn't real sharp in the first, got hit around, but really more so, didn't throw a ton of strike. Ah, ground ball, and that's through the infield. Now a long throw home, safe at the plate. It's three zip. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Chris, when you think about Aaron Nola, he's one of the better pitchers in the National League. And you think about that curveball, really good pitch for him. He was the seventh overall pick in 2014 out of LSU the next offering misses and that's ball two yeah and this is a guy the kick in the pitch runner goes strike in there throw tag ow a bullet from JT Real Muto usually when you see a team try to steal a base in the early innings it tells you they want to be aggressive on offense try to force the and there's the third out that'll do it for the inning but they pick up one run on the RBI single Back here in Philadelphia, Nick Castellanos at the plate now. Now this is in the air down the line. Tries to make the play, but it's foul. Foul. We'll see another payoff pitch. pitch now fly ball to right center Robles on his way over makes the grab tracks it down after the long run one up one down well, those can be pretty fun as an outfielder got to put it into his highest gear and go a long way to track that one down nothing better than that you feel like a wide receiver playing football and that's a base hit so a man aboard now with one away Good two strike hitting right there Boog a bit of a lost art for some so that was nicely done to beat the odds it's hard to hit a baseball much better than that and even a lot of professional hitters aren't able to reach an exit velo of 114 miles per hour I'll tell you what that's a very impressive swing of the bat. Here's a one two. Just oh. misses with that one really good take two especially strikes. with two strikes. And there's a hit. They fired in quickly. So it's first and second with only one away. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. And that one finds its way through. Tag, not in time. He's safe. And now just a two-run deficit. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. And here is, in the air, foul off first. And there's two away. Oh, that's a frustrating at bat right there. Big opportunity and just missed it. I know he wanted to do some damage. Next guy will have to pick him up. So the lineup flips over. Trey Turner now. And a pitch. Now it gets away from Ruiz. Runners stay put, and the count moves to two and one. The two one. Oh. Boom. The runner at third. Stubbs on at second with two down. Left field. 
And they get Turner for the out. And that is that. So one run in the inning on this base hit. It's now a th Back here in Philadelphia. Now the number two hitter, Luis Garcia. On the ground, right side. Paul takes That's it to the bag and one away in the top of the third. Joey Manessis digging in for the Nationals. He was a strikeout victim his first time. The next pitch misses two, two and ball. one. One strike. A little bit no, low. That's a ball. And there's ball, ball four. four. Boog, if I were him, I'd be nibbling around the plate as well. I mean, this guy is just capable of hitting pitches outside of the zone and driving them a long way. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Well, just a beautiful fastball on the inside corner for that backwards K right there. I think the hitter saw it all the way coming from that opposite arm. We all got to pause on that thought as that'll do it for bottom of the inning here's the catcher JT Real Muto one one now now one out to right grabs it on the run one away here's Bryce Harper 0 for one so far here's a one one Way high. Way to lay off that fastball up right there. You're looking for something you see well that you can handle, but you also have to keep the discipline so that you're not popping up pitches that are just a little too high. You're Swing good. and a miss, and now two and two. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good, and then by the time it gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. Two down. Well, that event seemed to be over as soon as it started. Three-pitch strikeout. You've got to be better at the plate right there, at least to foul something off, extend that at bat. Here's a 1-1. Ball two. Swing and a miss. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. And now the count filled up three and two. Lifted in the air, right center field. Robles settles under this one. He's there. He's got it. And that is that. Right-hander kicks deals. That's hard hit on the line. Rojas puts the squeeze on that one. And there's one down. Kicks and fires. Out into left center for a line drive base hit. Jeter downs to the plate here. Singled and drove in a run his first time through. That's to third, and it stays fair. The throw to third. Lead runner holds at third, so two runners in scoring position and just one out. Here's the third baseman, Brady House. His first at bat was a strikeout. Now a check swing at the 1-1. Look down to first. No swing. He held up. Carl Dixon with the call there. The 2-1. Fought off foul. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Here's a 1 1. He had him out in front, which isn't easy to do against a hitter like this, known for using the entire field. Ah, that ends the inning, so we take a break. So Ready to go for the last half of the inning. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Nick Castellanos. 3 1 now. And a swing and a miss. You know, these Phils doing a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient at bats out of him. He's only given up one run, but the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there. And that might be the best news yet for this offense. Robles in position, pulls it in, and there's one away. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage. And that might be the case today. And now the first baseman, Derek Hall. The 1 1. Swing and a miss as he was late. One ball, two strikes. Swing.
Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Really love the pitch sequence right there. I'm telling you what, pitcher and catcher on the same page right now. And now it's Alec Bohm, and he's already singled in this game. Strike One, two. two. He's gotten into a really good rhythm, sat down seven in a row. He just wants to get the baseball and deliver it as quickly as possible. Keep the momentum going. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. Here's the second baseman, Luis Garcia. <laughs> two, two down. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Now it's the right fielder, Joey Manessis. Bounce to third. To first, two up, two down. Yadiel Hernandez digging in for the Nationals. One for two. He had an RBI base hit back in the first. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Good battle here. About to be the eighth pitch of the at-bat. And he grounds one to the right side. Stubbs on to first. That ends the frame. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Now it's the second baseman, Garrett Stubbs. And now two balls and a strike. Activity in the Washington bullpen. Erasmo Ramirez looks to be getting ready for Dave Martinez. Harvey getting cranked up as well. Up the middle. What a stop. Throw to first. On the money. Nice play. Well, you can see right there, he looks very comfortable going to the backhand. Nice diving stop. Gets up to complete the play. That'll fire the boys up for sure. Broken bat, and it's popped up. On to Chavis. Out on a bang-bang play, but he made it close. Here's Turner now. The 2-1. On the ground. Fires to first on the run. In there safely. Did a nice job getting there. Good throw, but very difficult to get anybody on that one as far as you had to go and throw. You know? Yeah, no question. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. Dives and makes the catch. Great diving catch to end the inning after the pitcher battles through a tough one. That'll fire up the dugout. All set for the top of the sixth. And now, Hebert Ruiz. The other way. Schwarber right there to make the grab. And there's one down. The wind of the pitch. Up the middle. And that chance handled. He's in there. See, Boog, that right there, that's a perfect example of why he shouldn't be out there at that position. He clearly isn't comfortable. He doesn't look fluid. His footwork's all over the place. And just can't make that throw to beat the runner. On the ground to the left. And it gets by him. Call around third. The relay to the plate. Slide save. It's 4-1. There he is coming through with the knock right there. I like the fact that he can pick him up and put him down a little bit. First baseman aren't known for the speed, but seem oh, this ball's down, and that could bring in a run. Stop sign goes up at third. Runners at the corners with one out. Well, a swing like that can help you come out of this struggle. We saw the numbers coming into the ball game, but all he's trying to do at this point is help his team win. It feels to me like his time on the mound is running short, starting to show some signs of fatigue. So let's see how much longer they let him go. Dunks one into left. One runs in, and they hold the runner at third. Bases remain loaded here. Still only one gone. And now it's Luis Garcia. Swing and a miss. And that is strike two. Back up the middle and a base hit. One run is in. The throw in. He beats it safe. 
And it's now a six-run lead. Well, he found himself behind in the count right there, but he didn't give in. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. Next offering upstairs. Well, they've been able to score four runs off of him in this inning, and this is where you want to just... Oh, now this ball gets down. Turner, relay to third. The tag out. But they do get a run at the plate. Twelve-seven, your final score for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding.